Hi. About a year ago, I did a video about um, Indian Kostis, Urdu. And a lot of people, it was on Facebook, and a lot of people have, uh, many thousands of people have contacted me, have uh, left uh, remarks there. And I think it's, many of them have objected to my writing the title in English and then doing a video in a different language, which they do not understand. So I always want you to do the same video in English for people who cannot sp speak that language. Uh, one more thing was that um, what is uh, Indian Gostis? It is a root of a herb which grows somewhere in Himalayas in mountainous region where the mineral content of the soil is so high and it's so rich that the roots pull and the, this part which is saturated with mineral is the root compared to the rest of it and the roots are very very hard i've broken a couple of machines in an attempt to uh, powder them at home you wouldn't be able to do it so if you're buying it it's easily bought from um, uh, middle east uh, most middle eastern countries sell it um, in their herbal shops and uh, uh, if they're trying to sell because it's cheaper there are two kinds one is um, slightly palish yellowish which is called light cost costis and then there is a darkish one the darkish one is much more effective although if it's not available the um, lighter one will do the trick it will help you but it's not as potent as the darker one and uh, it's cheaper as well so it's it's more readily available because it's cheaper and the shopkeeper always tries to sell you the lighter version of it insist on buying the darker version because it's more beneficial number two and if if they're trying to sell you it is in root form um then do not do, do not think that you'll easily be able to powder it so buy it in powdered form so that you can uh, quickly start uh, using it for children if you're trying to uh, try it on children with autism or any you know dyslexia or any psychological thing um, disorders give them bath in it okay because they wouldn't be able to it's very bitter and very unpleasant um so they wouldn't be able to take it but in even from the bath water a lot of the minerals will diffuse um and then you know um they'll absorb some of the some of it number two was that if you start getting because a very powerful uh, uh, symptom of detoxification when your body is healing is um, nightmares after using this um, if you start getting nightmare and it, and people who have got very low immunity will actually experience that if that happens you're supposed to put loads of it in bath water and stand on it allowing the diffused uh, smell to uh, get into your body from all openings that usually gets get rid, rid of the um, nightmares but um, these symptoms are all a sign that you are actually uh, they are getting they are soaking in and they are now going to start pulling all the toxicity from brain and these different regions and eventually throw them out um, so so this is Indian Costis. Can I have a bowl, Mubasha, please? Mm -hmm. So, um, I I discovered Indian Costis when I had a very serious illness for which there is apparently no cure. And um, then, this was one of the amazing things that made a huge difference. Okay. It looks like this. Can you see? Kind of brownish uh, spice, as if it's a mixed spice. The flavor is awful. It's it's not as pleasant as no or pleasant at all, and but the benefits are amazing and it's not tasty either. Okay, however, when you start using it, mixing it with water and then making a solution with it, I'm going to do it in the end because that will make my mouth really really bitter. Okay, and then drinking it, it within a few days. You're only supposed to do it one teaspoon for 14 days for illnesses that are either psychological or are really deep okay so nothing is on the surface nothing for which uh, the doctor can give you antibiotic or things like this and it will go away something that is chronic for all chronic illnesses this is the medicine so the way to use this is one teaspoon in water and you drink it after 14 days or within 14 days your immune system will throw something out a very common thing that happens to people is their throat gets inflamed and they get a rash in their mouth which slowly eases off with um, with the use of a lot of uh, you know alkaline water um, hot water with uh, apple cider vinegar in it or so but the day that happens you will notice that so many and this has this has this is this has worked for so many people now and they all agree to the way it works okay so 
you you m- most of the time have a, a very bad throat but then you notice all those annoying diseases that were in your body for so long are gone and that is and then you realize that it's it is something which is amazing so these for 14 days in water for any illnesses which haven't surfaced yet but are chronic and have especially autoimmune and psychological illnesses and if you have something um like a persistent cough or the cough has just started it's it's a very stubborn symptom okay in um, uh, through infection in throat and those sort of things within a day they get cured with if you you know if you do gargling if you do uh, alum water if you do apple cider vinegar with the uh, turmeric so there's so many things but um if you if you uh, if you have a stubborn cough afterwards it usually takes long to go so half of teaspoon half of a, a teaspoon of this mixed with raw honey or manuka honey and then having it little by little cures really chronic cough in a day maybe two sometimes okay so this is amazing you can mix it with water and it turns into this um very unpleasant um juice so most of these things are are obviously we have we have tasted a lot of starchy fried food they taste good but you have to pay uh, you have to pay a very heavy price for them so this one is not probably that tasty but then it's worth it i told you it's it's going to be like this but you have to make sure that you're drinking it quickly not not smelling it because otherwise you wouldn't be able to have it the benefits although far outweigh the little discomfort you would experience while drinking it or you can put it in a capsule i don't know find a way maybe mix it with honey and then have water after that good luck bye